Minasan konnichiwa. This is David. And Mina. And tonight we are unboxing um, a kit and a half. We are unboxing the Transient Gundam Glacier, which was just released um, about a week or so ago. Um, and this is from um, what Tri Island War, or actually, sorry, it's from Tri Hono, mm -hmm. um, or Gundam Build Fighters Hono. Uh, which is where the Wing Zero Hono comes from. We got that kit, uh, kit. earlier this year. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, but, yeah, this is a variant of the Transient Gundam from Build Fighters Tribe. Which I love. Yes. Um, also, we have the HJ Build Weapon Callet Witch Fetter, which is um, an expansion kit for it um, that is featured in this month's episode issue of Hobby Japan. Actually, it's technically January's issue, but it's complicated. <laughs> um, so anyway, it was a pack-in on that, um, but I had to get it because I'm really, really digging the, um, the glacier. Yeah, the glacier, the first place we saw it was at the expo. Yeah, yeah. In, the... in our expo video, we it was the first reveal of it, um, and it's lovely. Unbelievable. And b back then it was... Um, it was the all white prototype version, um, mm. and I would have bought it like that. But now it's all pretty and sparkly and purple. So, all right. anyway, let's pop open the transient Gundam Glacier first. Oh God, I already love those colors. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna pop it so I can see it without the Changing. bag. Yeah. All right, so we got frame pieces. Um, this is standard Bill Fighters frame pieces. This actually looks pretty much identical to the Transient Gundams, which is fine. I built a Transient. I modded it. Did you build a Transient? Uh, the Transient Gundam? Uh, I can't remember if I built one or not. It's. Um, oh, no, no, no. You built the Transient. I built the Denial. Yeah, you built I the Denial. I keep thinking this is like part Denial because of the purple. No, 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 no. This is, this is the Transient, the white and blue one. Yeah. Um, so that purple is basically pure sex. I love this <laughs> color. I love it so much. Um, it's like my favorite color ever. And it's, um, yeah, it's, it's lovely. So it's like a royal purple. Mm. Um, and we have all these nice edgy pieces, uh, all of sharp. these blades. Yeah, it's a very sharp, very edged kit. Ooh, it comes with a stand. Yeah. It should all come with them, but I really like when they do. A lot of the Bill Spider ones do, especially the spacey ones. Yeah, yeah, because they're not really not balanced to stand up very well. And it's nice. That's a good workaround. Yeah, it's a nice clear black um, stand. Mm, and I mean, the God, these are so easy to put in everything. They right? should. Ugh. Dear Bandai. Dear Bandai, do it, please. <laughs> Okay, and here is um, here's our, our bluish purple. Mm -hmm. um, that's our sort of flat color to, color, you know, round out some of the accents. In the camera, in the viewfinder, it's definitely coming out very blue, mm -hmm. but it's definitely in real life, it's definitely more of a purple. Blue. Yeah, it's yeah, it's somewhere between blue and purple. Okay. We have polycaps. Polycaps. And we have, this is like a grayish purple. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's a real taupey purple. Oh, that's a good word for it. Why, thank you. That's yeah, lovely. yeah, yeah. And there's our GN drive and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. So it's lovely. The cats are at war behind us because we're going growling. That's just that. Yeah, they're upset because we just put up a Christmas tree and we won't let them play with it. They're so mad. Yeah, if you see the, the Wing Zero Custom as our <laughs> topper there. And it's not even done yet. Wait till you no, see. No, 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 no. It's going to be absurd. And we got two of these B-Runners. Um, two of these B-Runners. This is a darker grayish color. And actually, it almost I think it has a hint of purple in it. Maybe. I don't know. I can't tell. But yeah, it's 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 just, you know, dark grayish. Whatever. And, and the glacier is symmetrical. Yeah, the, the, the transient so glacier is. The, I mean, so is the other transient. It's very much so. Symmetry. And let's see. Okay, so we've got this is actually the piece here. Um, oh, it's telling you go find yeah, this go magazine because this. this thing is in there. Um, so yeah, that's lovely. Um, and then we've got a couple more ads. It's for funny other to things. me that they show it with the um, with the Wing Zero Hono. Yeah. Yeah. I think whenever they developed it, the the uh, whenever they took these initial pictures, this was probably before the Transient Glacier was finished. Right. Because at that point, we were still talking about a prototype, which doesn't make for good ads. Mm -mm. They also have it with the scramble. Actually, it looks really pretty with the scramble. The blue and the orange, it's nice. Yeah. Okay, 
Okay, and so here is our Transient Glaciers booklet. Um, I know very little about this manga, uh, but... Girl Pilot. Yeah, Girl Pilot. It's just kind of cute. Um, God, it's pretty. I'm really eager to see it. And it's like, yeah, that used to be cool. Yeah. <laughs> and it looks like their team is... Um, Lapis. It looks like a Fenice, a uh, Fenice Renishita variant, or a mm -hmm. Wing Zero of some sort. Mm -hmm. And then we've got the Glacier, of course. And then we have what looks to be an Astray. That actually looks like the, um, that looks like the Astray for that Niels Nielsen piloted. Mm, it's a blue, though. Yeah, but it's a blue frame instead of a red, and it has a battle axe. Mm. If you know more about that manga, let us know what that is. Yeah, please. Okay, so, you know, just standard kit stuff. Mm. That backpack is gorgeous. That's so cool. Mm. And, of course, it's nice. Build Fighter, so you can just plop that on anyone you want. Right. God, I almost want to get one of these to put on something else. Like a bear guy? Like a bear guy, I or I was I was thinking more like a, um, like a Build Strike. Yeah, it look nice on a Build Strike. Yeah. Okay, and then here we go. Um, ads... <laughs> Um, yeah. Does it have any advice for doing things? I, I no, because like you don't want to do anything to it. It's all clear pieces. Yeah, I know. It's all gorgeous, oh. shiny, glittery pieces. Customized plan. There's actually no, yeah, there's, there's no, no little advice thing. I always like those, though. They're really cute. Okay, mm -hmm. so that's that. All right. Um, I'm going to toss this back in the box real quick. I am so eager to put the st oh stickers 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 just a couple which is good I hate yeah, stickers so. so true yeah and they look like pretty pointed pretty simple stickers if you were wondering what the black thing was under a Christmas tree they are spiky mats that are supposed to keep cats from um, getting on places and as you can see they totally work yeah yeah they're not very good at that okay so let's pop Japanese this thing Japanese technology open. that doesn't work it's pretty rare actually they work in some capacity but the cats learn very quickly. Yeah. At least she's not comfortable. <laughs> yeah. That's what's important here. Yeah. Mildly annoyed. Okay. They're very good cats. I can't blame them. For them. I want some of this Christmas presents. Oh, it's blue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a little bit different in coloring. Mm. Uh, but the idea is the team that they come from, the Team Lapis Lazuli, so they all use blue-ish kits, blue variant kits. Mm. And so, you know, blue weapons. Mm -hmm. Good job. Woo. Yeah. <laughs> okay, there we it's go. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah, this is gonna be super cool whenever mm -hmm. it gets put together. Yeah, very much spiky. But it's a one sheet edgy. piece, real nice. Yeah, and oh check that out. Look at that. It comes with a new V fin mm -hmm. that matches it. See if we can get that to focus. There you go. There we go. Yeah, Lovely. yeah. That's gorgeous. And this is not the glittery. No, it's this just straight like up. A, just a clear. Let me see if I can find real quickly. Let's see if I can find the instructions. They're mm -hmm. always in here, but they're sometimes hard to find. Mm -hmm. She's sitting there, but she's not happy. Oh. Of course we find the bear guy. Mm -hmm. I need to do a custom bear guy in art form, like to draw one, mm. to do as our mascot. Mm. And we have to do a December bear guy. Oh yeah, we do. My plan is to do one a month. That's a good idea. Yeah. Be a fun little art project. Because, mm -hmm. you know, I have any more room anywhere for any more. Okay, things. so let's see. Oh, mm. Wing Zero, Hono 2. And I. I see they're ad. Well, no, this is this is just the Hono. They're just advertising it uh, as uh, in a way that you can modify to make that. Oh, it's really lovely. Mm -hmm. Oh, so I guess it's a Hono weapon, one way or the other. It doesn't. Mm. That's so weird. It, it Gunpla Expo they advertised it as a um, 
as a weapon for the glacier, but mm. it looks like it's actually for the Hono. Maybe they just had to put it somewhere and they weren't going to put it in the... Yeah, don't home. matter. <laughs> anyway, that means it's a second expansion kit for the Hono. Mm. Yeah, so that's what it ends up looking like. I will do a um, review of it once I've got it put together and mm -hmm. everything. It'll be pretty easy. And I might pull out my old Hono to show you. <laughs> and I'll even I'll even show the first expansion kit, which is much, much less pretty. Mm -hmm. uh, but still pretty cool. Yeah. Okay, so anyway, yeah, it's all pretty simple. Mm -hmm. I mean, the instructions are right there. If you get one of these, like if you buy the box and you get the piece, um, let me know. I'll take a picture of the instructions and I'll put them up in PDF or something. Right, because so. if you get just the box, which some resellers do, yeah. it doesn't have the instructions. I mean, this is not crazy difficult, but if you need it, let us know. We'll yeah, help. yeah, just let us know. Because the magazines are very heavy, so I, I understand Shipping why people don't want to ship them. Yeah. Oh, actually, there they got a picture of the glacier holding it. Or something. I don't know. Something. But, yeah. Something purple. Anyway, there you go. Um, I'll toss the transient together. We'll give a, a, a review of it, and then we'll also give a review of this piece, um, and I'll show you what it looks like. And probably next up we'll have the um, petite kitten and puppy, because they're pretty much next up. Yeah, yeah, those will be released soon. Actually, Hobby Japan, that episode issue of Hobby Japan will probably have the actual re release date. I'm so excited. Yeah, so we'll see about that. Mm -hmm. um, Alright, so until next time, matane. Keep warm, matane.